Hello people, this is George with yet another Call of Dragons video. Today I wanted to take a video because new update came out. Uh, I just downloaded the update and I want to speak about this update because uh, I think it's the biggest update I have ever seen in Call of Dragons. Uh, there's a lot of things to unpack. Uh, most importantly, there is a war pets. Like everybody knows, Call of Dragons and Rise of Kingdoms are kind of similar games, but Rise of Kingdoms does not have any kinds of pets, which is a new feature for us. And let's see, let's discover. I will like it will be first time for me to discover the pets too. Uh, whenever you're gonna log in, when the update is uh, here, you're gonna have a choice to have to click on four different uh, war pets. I chose this one. It's called Sapphire Phaedrake. I chose this one because um, in the video, in the small photo, it was shown that it's a flying unit. I think every each of them are epic ones, like from the four uh, pets which you can choose. I chose this one because I saw that she it was flying, and I I think flying in this game is pretty cool. As you can see, like any other heroes, uh, pets has a base attributes which are spirit, luck, agility, strength, intelligence, and endurance. Right. Also, pets uh, have a skills. Uh, these skills does not do a lot of damage or a lot of uh, like stat bonuses, as you can see, zero point three percent. 0.3%, but they do actually have a lot of skills. Training, uh, like re regenerate means, like if you want to try regenerate, I would not suggest you to do it at first, uh, like learn what they do. Regenerate means to reset skills and the base stats of the, of the pets. Uh, I won't gonna do it because I'm not experienced enough to try something like that. And just, just for the information, the regenerate means you're gonna be resetting all the skills, all the stats on your pet, right? Also, here, here is a uh, skill card. As as I as I think, it's just a, a chest, right? From where you can open the eight pool and the whatever skill you're gonna get, you will be putting on your pet, right? Here is a small shop with its own currency like uh, as you as you understand you can uh, randomly get a skill or you can buy it from here like specific skill which you feel like will be better version for your pet and for your army and also you, as I, as you can see you can sell it i don't have any cards right now to sell that's why it's empty also uh, where is um, give me a second here uh, let's say you chose this keys as the first pet, right? And you want to have more pets. You're gonna go to the world map. You're gonna go to the search, and here this is new icon called beasts. You can even choose what whichever uh, beast you want to capture. Like I wanted to capture like same uh, beast Sapphire Frederick as I chose to have, but there is none. Let's see if there will be like a none. Let's let's just click all and let's see how it will do. See, as I as I as I see, you can you will be just uh, let's continue capture here. As you can see, you don't need to attack it. You don't need to kill it. You will be capturing it. Uh, like it's pretty simple. You won't gonna be lost, right? Uh, every single thing which is added into this game is pretty simple and pretty easy. Also, as you noticed, like when I came to the game after the update, my game was really, really clean. I don't know, guys, if you are playing on phone or if you are playing on computer or PC, PC is way better. When I'm hovering my mouse, I can see the name of the building, which is pretty cool. Also, let's see if they changed anything more, right? Like, as I remember, they said when you're gonna hover to the somebody's... Uh, yeah, as you can see, it's pretty crisp, it's pretty cool looking. They made a lot of changes regarding the gathering uh, items. Like, this is a gold mine, which was looking pretty different in the past. Even, uh, like, 
They, and I think they upgraded the graphics of the game, which is uh, amazing. Like better graphics are better quality of life changes for the game, which means they are thinking about the graphics and thinking about how the game will look in general. Regarding pets, as you can see here, you can put this pet, but a pet needs to be at least two level. After it's a two level, you will be able to take your pet outside of the uh, of your of your town. Let's see how the training can be done, right? Like um, I'm still looking how it will be uh, added to the game, like how it will change the perspective of the game. But so far, I like what I'm I, what I'm seeing. I, I like the visuals. I like the idea of like uh, farming the pets, leveling them up, uh, getting the new skills for it. Right? Uh, I think there it like pets won't gonna change a lot. Uh, I was worried that pets would be destruction for a free to play players because as you can see, as you know, I am hundred percent free to play. Uh, I am not going to spend any money in this game because I'm having fun grinding and I'm having fun to to fight with the people who are spending money in the game, right? Like, as you saw, just I don't even have Lilia. Uh, pretty good. Let's see if there is a new heroes added, which are they did not yet, but we already know there will be two cavalry heroes. One will be flying flying heroes for eagles finally spring wardens got their hero it was pretty late but it's better than never right so this is my take like i won't gonna go in details what they what they changed because everybody can read right my reading won't gonna change the opinion of the people it's here it's easy to understand and it's easy to read, right? Uh, that's why I won't gonna go into details. Uh, that I, end up, I I wanted to show you know, my opinion and my view regarding the graphic change, regarding the most important change, the pets, which is new a uh, thing, and we will be learning and learning more and more regarding pets. And I'm sure there will be a lot of updates <coughs> regarding pets, a lot of tweaks. Uh, but so far, so good. I don't see anything bad. I don't see anything worrying. This game is progressing pretty fast for its genre. And I think it will go much, much higher because we already have one feature which is not seen in the Rise of Kingdoms. This is Warpits, which I, I just do. Just because it's not in the Rise of Kingdoms, I already like it. Uh, because there's a, there are a lot of similarities regarding two games. So uh, I think uh, this game will go far and I, I think you guys will be enjoying the gameplay and enjoying the future of this game. I will try my best to upload the videos. I'm not uploading the videos every single day uh, because like every single day I don't think that's a good idea. Like right now if there is not a content in the whole game to be uploading like every single day uh, I'm uploading videos whenever I try something whenever something new uh, comes out whenever I find out something special or I, I want to share my personal opinion uh, thanks for watching share your opinions and ideas about this update and let's talk about it in the comments if not just enjoy the video bye bye